Aloha! In the last episode, we enclosed the pontoons. Now it's time to start putting them together. The next step is to get these pontoons on the ground, leveled out, and 8 feet apart from outside edge to outside edge. To do this, the boys and I needed to create four supports for the pontoons. We came up with a simple design and knocked them out. These little supports work great. We are easily able to slide the pontoons around so that we can get them in the right place and the correct distance apart, which is 8 feet from outside edge to outside edge. I need to build five cross supports to connect these two pontoons together. I've decided to use PVC pipe, which I've cut in half for all the way down the length to give me a nice U-shaped channel that I can use as a form to create the cross supports. I want to make these supports really strong, so each one is going to get three layers of 1708 covering the entire U-shaped channel as well as flanges on either side. There'll be a serious amount of overlappage, about two feet in the middle, so actually six layers in the middle will help to make sure that these are very, very strong. Before mixing any resin, I get all the material cut out and I wax the form and the table thoroughly. Fresh resin in a fresh tray, it's almost beautiful. Here you can see the layup is finished. We've got the entire PVC pipe covered, as well as a four inch flange on either side. Fiberglass separates from PVC easily and makes a nice mold. I'm going to use five of these U-channel cross supports to connect these pontoons. The U-channel provides an incredible amount of rigidity and stabilization. And the first piece is in. Just use one layer of 1708 to tack it in place. That way I can come back in once it's dried and add more layers of fiberglass to reinforce it. I still need to make a cover for this tray and enclose the entire thing. And that completes the unit, providing a ton of support. Here on the bottom you can see the Gorilla Tape that I was using to temporarily hold it in place while I added the pieces of fiberglass to the top. This is a pretty big moment because from here on they will be forever connected together as one unit instead of the separate pontoons they've been.